Ghost. They want the win so bad. They've been working for months and months on end. Just like that, the perfect stall from Slurpee Thief. You see Berkeley are your Overwatch Test Buck Collegiate Series Grand Champions. Well, we're gearing up right now for the national tournament of the year. It's the Test Buck Collegiate Series for Overwatch. We're coming back to defend our title and hopefully take it away again. The pressure's definitely on. Um, as we get closer to the date, we all message on our Facebook saying we need to play a lot more, um, we need to practice a lot more. That'd probably be about 16 to 18 hours a week. Round one, round one, nice. The hero I play is Zenyatta. He's a healer who also does a lot of damage. Two teams try to capture certain points on a map or push cards to a certain distance. Whoever does it better than the other team wins the game. There's a story behind each character so that you feel more like you are a hero within that world and you are trying to do something and accomplish a mission rather than out there, you know, mindlessly shooting bad guys or stuff like that. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. With schools like Irvine implementing their esports program and San Diego, who brought most of their players from last year, and so they've played together for a year now. This year's looking a little more tough. Nice. Get Lucio, get Lucio, get Lucio. A joke amongst our teammates is that we're really good under pressure just because of how difficult Berkeley midterms are. <laughs> just stop. Oh, I'm gonna die here. How did he get me? Playing the game can be stressful at times. So when we go out and have fun, we just try to really bond together more as friends rather than as teammates or players. We all get to know each other. We all talk about other video games. We talk about academics. That's really important for a team because then it's not just you go and play and then that's it. It's more like you have friends. Esports has been growing in leaps and bounds over the past several years. We're seeing that some of the largest esports tournaments, like the League of Legends tournament, are attracting over 32 million viewers every year. Being in an esports tournament is just like, you know, you're going to the craziest football game you've ever been. You know, walking in, you feel like just the air is on fire with excitement. You know, you have people jumping up, you know, swinging their shirts around, screaming and yelling for their favorite teams. It's just one of the most exciting environments I've ever been in. $60,000 in the collective pockets. How does that feel? What does that mean uh, taking home this championship? Uh, some of us are graduating. For some of us, they'll help pay for you know, our scholarships, bills. The possibilities are endless, so I can't wait for the future. This year's looking a little more tough, close? but we've put in the time and we've put in the effort. So I feel like we'll be able to bring the victory home for Cal.